Yeah, this is Beverly. And on Wednesdays, I like to take my pants off and listen to Devin Anus Tart make prank calls. But you better not ever call my phone again. And this is your final warning. Um, uh, Chi Chi, if you don't mind, I just played basically two songs and that makes me nervous to play more than that. Okay. So I'm going to just chill on that for a second. Um, hold on. I got to restart this because apparently, apparently, uh, Bear wants me to not cuss in the first 20 minutes. So we're going to, we started a timer. So hi, hi. I have a couple announcements. I'm a little quiet. I'm quiet. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Am I quiet? What's going on with my sound? Oh. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> I guess I can't. I don't know. Am I quiet? What's going on? Let me look at my sounds. Hello, sounds. Sounds. I just need to yell. Do I need to yell? I need to yell. Okay. I don't know. <gasps> oh, what kind of skills are we talking about? Vesper? Okay. Definitely don't. That could get you in trouble. Okay, thanks. Yeah, I had the thing away from my mouth hole. So, you know. All right, cool, cool. What was I? Oh, yeah. Uh... <laughs> It's just, we're trying um, YouTube things, I guess, about it. And he's like, I took out all the cussing in the first 20 minutes. And he didn't really ask me to. I just thought I would. So maybe next week. Oh, God, I just said the F word again. Mm. Back to my announcements. One announcement. Monday. Next Monday. It's going to be a really big milk box show. I'm going to need you guys all to come hang out and listen to milk box or else. And we need a cuss counter. <laughs> oh, no, no. And, uh, okay, I'm nervous. So what else? Oh, yeah. Um, I don't know if you guys know, um, a very long time listener and fan of the prank calls, uh, Wolf has passed away um and that makes my heart sad he was a good man and he did some calls i got to do calls with him back in the day uh, but anyways i do suck at this i know i can't i still have 12 minutes is there a purpose to have <laughs> this timer on anymore i don't think so but whatever okay all right yeah, he was great. <gasps> Did you? Oh, Bray. Yeah, Wolfcock was the bomb. So, R.I.P., dude. He was a good guy. And also, he's a Patreon. You've reached his answering machine. Please leave a message and she'll return your call. To keep <laughs> Listen here, Sue. I had a question for you. Give me a call back. Okay, thanks. Bye. Yeah. Ooh. Now him and Daisy are hanging out in um, the afterlife, though. So that's good. How did he die? If you know, he had cancer. Yeah. He had cancer. Yeah. Oh, thank you, Andy Anderson. You little stinky, little stinky butthole. Okay. Where am I now? I think that was all. Milk box and, um, yeah, that. Okay. He was definitely a smoker. Uh-huh. <clears throat> and he drank a lot. He didn't live the cleanest life, but which one of us does? And if you do, don't admit it, because then we'll all make fun of you. Okay, thanks. There's milk box. Oh, yeah. I forgot. Somebody made me a really cool spoopy song. Uh, hold on. I think it was here. I think it's called... No, not Ghosts Are Real. Scared Tactics. 
Hold on. I might come blasting. Whoa, watch your ears! Okay. Oh, where's the volume on this thing? Oh, no. Oh, there it is. <laughs> I'm sorry. I was blasting everybody out with some spoopy music. Alright, now everybody, Monday, don't miss out. Yeah, he did I have. He's a good guy. Well, I don't know. Alright, we ready? I think we're ready. We've got some scare tactics. A soul loud, yeah? Is that loud for you guys too? Okay. <laughs> Sorry. Alright, now we've got these right here. I want to call this guy, but I guess we'll just have to wait. Car okay. Okay, I'm the person you think you dinged my car. Yeah. At Goodwill. Yep. And I just wanted to let you know it might be okay because I bought that car with that ding in it. <laughs> Aww. Call me sometime and we'll see. Mm. I'm three. I'm at three one nine. Oh, don't do it, lady. Why would you do that? Okay, thank you. Sorry. <laughs> okay. Aww. Hey, New Jersey John. What is up? All right. Julie Rickluff. Mm. I love After you. you have finished your mess. What? Mm. Is her name Jubilee? Uh, what? Jubilee Rickluff. Rickluff? What is Rickluff? After you have finished your message, you. just hang up. Or to hear more options, please press 1. Uh, Jubilee, it's Rachel. I need to talk to you because we're going to be best friends. All right. Thank you. Give me a call back. <laughs> yeah. Ice Cat has the COVID, you guys. Everybody point and laugh at him. It was not Jubilee Brectum and Nunu. All right. Let's see here. Mm hmm. <laughs> what is that room? <laughs> you guys, you guys are sick. All right. Um, what is this? Hi, Roy. My name is Chad. Is I was Chad? calling in regards to a note that was left on my wife's car. Mm. Uh, please give me a call back. Three one nine. Chad, why don't you put your wife on the phone? She isn't man enough to deal with her own car. She just kidding. Oh, I got him cussing still. Oh, I just watched a movie where they were talking about old up start 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 was like his he helped him not be nervous. It was a super cheesy movie. Your call has been forwarded to voicemail. The person you're trying to reach is not available. At the tone, please record. Please record. Please record. Okay. Did Greta tell you that in a bizarre coincidence we found out? Oh, <gasps> Vesper, that's awesome. Hell yeah. And get crazy. Because that would be fun. <laughs> I need to go visit too. Let's go visit. All right, we're looking up. Right, next time, do you okay? Chad, okay. Hi, I'm leaving this message for Roy. The next time you decide to leave a fucking note on my car saying stop snorting for our park loser, next time figure out who the fear is speaking to because I wasn't snorting. I have my skin child with me, you dumb s So don't leave nothing else in my car, you dumb s <laughs> Wait. Fucking no my car is being stop snorting for you bark. <laughs> Who did that? You guys are bad.
Okay, let's see. <laughs> hold on, hold on. I gotta grab these first, cause okay, she's fancy. I like her. What should I tell her? I feel like she, maybe she made Roy cry, and she should apologize for that nasty voicemail. Nasty. Okay. <laughs> You guys are sick. All right. Gordo's fine art. Oh, oh, you know what? Somebody else made me a cool little butthole picture. <laughs> All of them cool butthole pictures. Mail. The person you're oh. trying to reach is not available. At the tone. That's not true, is it? Mm -hmm. Hello? Hello? Uh, yes? Yeah, you left my boyfriend, Roy, a message, and you really hurt his feelings, so I was just wondering if maybe you could apologize. Um, no, I cannot apologize, because what he left on my, on the car that day, that was very rude of him to assume that somebody was sniffing cold while I'm with my <laughs> two-year-old child parking in a parking lot. So I'm not going to apologize for anything. What he needs to do is apologize for what the foot on the car. Maybe you That's should that. listen to gangster rap with a two-year-old around, okay? Um, hey, um, nobody was listening to gangster rap. Um, is there anything else that you want from me? Because I'm about to hang up. No, this is his girlfriend. I got it, Dad. Don't worry. No, I got it. I got it. Don't worry. Uh, about put it. your dad on the no. phone. I'm sick of talking to children. No. Put your dad on the phone. You're you're not talking to a child. You're talking to a grown. Woman, so yeah, you right. Watch you're talking mm. to Whoa, maybe mm. that wasn't nice. Put your dad on the phone. <laughs> She's fancy. Okay, hold on. I'm trying to find my butthole picture. Where is my butthole picture? It's a picture of my actual butthole. <laughs> Just kidding. It's not. Don't get excited. Oh, there it is. Okay. Please fit. Please fit. Oh, it's too tall. I'm going to have to edit it. I'm going to need you to get these parameters off of me, milk box. Why can't I close this right now? Close. Will you just let me do one of these? Oh no, I broke. I broke it somehow. How did I break? Oh wait, I didn't break it. I just had to get it out of the file. Okay, hey, what's up? Hey, camp soup. <laughs> I gotta make it smaller. It's very. <laughs> Start with the whoops. Sorry. <laughs> since, since the no. Thank you. Okay. That was hilarious. She was so mad. <laughs> okay. This person said they're trying to control their rage right now. I don't really appreciate what you did. I'm trying to control my rage right now. Give me a call back because this is unacceptable. Okay, so this could be a fake. This could be a fake. Oh, okay, we can start cussing again. Thank God. Finally. <laughs> Finally. <gasps> oh, no, we missed a call. I hope it was from that sassy lady. Oh, no. Your call has been forwarded to voicemail. <laughs> the person you're trying to reach is not available. 
Oh, wait, they said no? Wait, did they just text me no? Did you say no? Mm. Hello? No! Hello, is this Dean? Who is this? Uh, it's Rachel. What's up? You hit my what you-, you hit my boyfriend's car. No. You dinged his car. No. Well, I think that's how it went down. What's going on? You left kind of a jerky text message. When? Oh my god, Friday? That's not the number. I, this isn't the number I called. Yeah, this is my number. You called my boyfriend and you were kind of an a- So I'm calling to make sure you're not going to come in hot and make him cry again. Your boyfriend was crying. Listen, buddy. Where's the damage? Nobody leaves notes like that for my man. Who This... What your what's your name? Rachel? I'm trying to control my rage right now. But I, I'm having a hard time, Dean. I, I should have called you. I could that spit. I could spit right now. I'm so mad. Pachoo. I brought Pachoo. it to the mechanic. They charged me eighty five dollars. They took a look at everything and everything's fine. So never mind. I don't know what this is about. You spent $85? Are you Canadian? No. You sound a little Canadian. What's that accent you got going on? What does that even mean? You you just sound like a... I I sound like an idiot? Is that what that means? I mean, I I said Canadian. I didn't say idiot, but basically. Well, you say Canadian, I hear idiot. Well, so, I that's not nice to the. Do you, why do you hate Canadians? What did they do to you? I'll just watch the news. I don't know what to tell you. What news station are you watching? Maybe we should. Maybe we should pray. Are you a religious man? No. <laughs> okay, neither am I. Thank God. Woof. That was gonna get awkward. Um, what's a, Rachel? Yeah. What are you calling about now? Well, you because okay. I called you, and now I'm telling you that I don't. It's well, fine. Y- yeah. Okay, but I you couldn't called... find anything. I was pretty pissed when I found it, but whatever. Well, you called, and you were kind of mean. You left a really sassy, um, like, get message, and. It really hurt his feelings, yeah, and, and now so, I'm getting, and well, now I'm getting a call from what was this Idaho or Indiana or somewhere. Well, my mom wants to talk to you too. Your so your boyfriend's Hello? car got hit, and then now uh, you. Yes, this what? is Beverly. Okay. Is this I, your car you? or whose car is this? Who the f*** is this? Are you the only one that has insurance in the family, or what's going on here? Well, what the f*** do you think this is? At this point, I really don't know. What is your problem? Do you have nothing better to do? Uh, Yeah, I do. Um... You know, I'm going to trace this phone call, motherfucker. Okay, you called me. You already know my... You mother. are a piece of... Yeah. And if you call my phone again, I'll okay, make sure you I don't ever get another phone anywhere, like honey. Five days. And it wasn't even your phone. It was Rachel's boyfriend's phone. 
I've got a tracer on my phone. I'm tracing this phone okay. call. And you know what? You have, I'm going to report you. What are you talking you. about? What are you talking about? You already have my number. Go ahead and report me. I've already talked to everybody. They don't know who the f*** you are. Uh. I think you're f***ing mentally ill. Well, okay. You can't even hardly probably walk or blow your nose. Are you, so I just, the reason I'm not hanging up is because I don't want you to keep calling me tonight. So we're not going to keep doing this, right? Beverly? You know something, the last four years, my house was considered one of the prettiest with a sign in the front in this area. Well, it's. What the f*** are you talking about? I live in a double-wide mobile home. With the beer stein? You try your f***ing shit with me anymore, buddy. I'll see you in jail for harassment. Where's the boyfriend at? I think I I'm going to see you in jail. Car. I'm a widow, and I know how to play that to the full extent. Dent. Yeah, all right. Well, I'm come to the house. Now. Let me show you what my concealed carry looks like. No, thank you. But I'm going to let you go now. I've kind of had enough of this. Come on over, I honey. The- my nephew is a sheriff. I'm reporting you to him. I didn't see any body damage and the mechanics looked at, you know, the suspension and the power train or whatever. You want to fucking play games, buddy? Play games. You know, after it happened, I thought I heard a weird noise, but I think I was just paying too much attention. So I just turned the radio up. Bye. If you start your fucking shit again, buddy, my gra- my uh, nephew can trace your number, well, even no. though you're using a burn phone. Okay. I'm not a nice lady, honey. I'm a motherfucking bitch. And I, I will can, rip your I fucking face off and shove I, it down your I, throat. What kind of a Christian plays your fucking game? Give me a break. May God strike you dead, you piece of shit. You need to go watch Silence of the Lambs again or something. I've talked to Richard, Teresa, and the security guard. How do you know Richard? How old are you? I already told you once before. My nephew is a deputy sheriff. I already got the first phone number that you called from. I will will get another phone number from you. They'll trace you down, and I'm going to see you in jail for harassment. Beverly, uh, I'm going to talk. I hope I don't talk to you later. I'm going to let you go because I called once, and that was it. I haven't been calling you. So if you're getting other calls, that's from somebody else. So I'll I'm gonna hang up now. I know how to play the widow bit to the full extent. What did he say, Mom? Why are you so pissed off? Hello? I think I have to end the Skype. It went blank. I couldn't do anything about it. That really is a real handful. Uh, Details. Oh, that Bev. Fucking Skype. It's my own fault. I'm living in the past. I'm prank phone calling in the past. Thanks. 
Uh, yeah, well, I mean, he wasn't like, hey, I prank called you and made a robot out of your voice because you're crazy. That guy was fun. He couldn't uh, hold in his rage. I'm a time traveler. Why am I a time traveler? Pants <laughs> room leave. What does this say? Sorry. Somebody just messaged me. He was so surprised she knew Richard. What does this person say? Sorry. Sorry, sorry. Sorry that you were a politician fixing to ask me for money. What? Oh, the no guy? Who's that? Uh. Okay, now I have to figure out who the no guy was. Oh, that was Dean. Okay. I don't know. I don't know how I feel about that. <gasps> this guy's rude. Hi, Rachel. Your voicemail was super gay. <laughs> wow. Rude. Oh, this is the Canadian. <laughs> he got offended when I asked if he was a Canadian. Okay. <laughs> Wait, is it still going? Why is it still going? Okay. Name take JK. Devon Anus Tart. Oh, yeah. Hey, friend. Hello? 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 Yeah, you said my voicemail was gay. That's rude as Sorry? hell. You said my voicemail was gay. I think I remember. Yeah. I left a note on your car, you son of a bitch. What's up? Nothing. What's up, you hoe? <gasps> Don't call me a hoe. I am a respectable lady. Alright. Did you see any damage on your car? I don't know. He go. <laughs> okay. Bullshit. <gasps> Ask if Kate is one of the <laughs> ugly sisters. No, no. <laughs> okay, hold on. Hold on, I'm almost done with these and then. Oh my gourd. He got a scurred. Don't be a scurred. But then why would he say my message is gay? He should talk shit about you. That hurts my feelings. Hi there. I got a note on my car for this number uh, saying that somebody sat on my hood and farted. And I was just curious. Um, if there was a reason or something else that happened. So I was just giving a quick call. Um, <laughs> if you want to give me a call back, that would be great. Uh, I'm not too sure what this was for, so I just wanted to check. <laughs> Have a good one. Okay. <laughs> so it's... It's awesome. <laughs> it was me. I did it. Okay. Notes on boots. Notes on boots. Okay. Yeah, well, 
I thought your mom was a man. He's gonna, his mom's going to be dead, huh? Hello? Hey, this is Paul Dillon here. Paul Sorry Burn. I missed your call. If you could leave your name, number, yeah, and reason for calling, I I'll try to get back to you as soon as I can. Thank you. Your mom. Hey, Paul. Um, I got a f- message from a lady, and you don't sound like a lady. So if you can have the lady give me a call back, that would be great. Thank you so much, Paul. Yo, yeah, well, I thought your mom was a man. Okay. We're just going to text that guy that. Okay, cool, cool. <gasps> Alan Hot Dogs? Well, I need to know more about hot dogs. Tell me about your hot dogs. Okay. Um. All right. All right. Here's a little clown. Oh, clown collection. Thank you. Thank you, Abdub. Okay. Call paste. Go. Yes. Fuck you, Beverly. What? Jennifer. Hi, Jennifer. I was calling about your clown collection. If you could give me a call back, I'd appreciate it. Thanks so much. Bye. Oh. Fuck you, Beverly. That's got to be a listener, too. You can't talk about talk to Beverly like that. Copy. No. No. Okay, I heard myself. There we go. Jennifer sounds like a clown collector. <laughs> she collects clown souls. My God, does anybody know clown clown collectors? Uh, dog collectors. <gasps> oh, that reminds me of my favorite. Hello. Hello? Hello? Hey, hey, it's Rachel. How are you doing? I'm doing good. Good. Um, so I was um flying my drone around in the area and I think it it's um it fell on your car and I just wanted to say I'm sorry. Well did it tear my vehicle up? No, it was just a drone. It didn't tear your vehicle up. I mean where do you I mean you said you threw your drone and it hit my vehicle, I mean what part of the vehicle did it even hit? Well, so it fell on the hood, on the top, the roof. <laughs> I mean, you said it fell on top of the roof. Did it take it? When it fell on top of the roof, did it scratch the vehicle? Well, when I got up there, I accidentally farted on the hood, and I didn't see a scratch. I mean, I'm just, I mean, I'm just asking. Can't see a scratch because it's dark. Uh, well, I already told you there's not a scratch, so maybe you can just shut the fuck up, asshole. It was an accident. I'm sorry. I mean, I'm not being an asshole. Why are you? Why are you talking to me like that, saying "shut the fuck up, asshole"? When you well, because you, you literally said, "Well, was there a scratch?" I said, "No, there's not a scratch," and you're like questioning I mean, me. But because because whenever you said you hit my vehicle, I mean, you didn't say. Oh, well, it's okay. I mean, I would just ask because, I mean, heck, you can't scratch a vehicle. Paint ain't hard to scratch. Well, I hit the vehicle on the peni- on its penis. I mean, are you flying a drone and you hit my vehicle? Or, or uh, I, mean, what, I mean, I'm out here by my vehicle. I mean, you hit the vehicle... And you and you and you picked your drone up. You had to come to where the drone was at. I mean, why was you flying a drone in this area, anyways? Because I was looking at stuff. Why do you have a oh, problem oh. with me flying a drone in this area? I mean, I mean, I was just asking because the drone, the drones in a, in a private park, anyway. So why would it be driving in the private park? Well, I'm making videos for my uh, TikTok. Okay, that's all. I didn't mean to. Um, sometimes I twerk in the, mm, like that. I mean, I, I mean, I'm just, just asking. you just hit your car? 
Are you going to try and blame that on me, too? You just hit it. No, I didn't. I, I didn't say that, but, I mean, I was just asking a simple question. I mean, furthermore, if you hit somebody's vehicle, I mean, you should have told them. I mean, hell, I didn't even know nobody hit my vehicle. I literally am calling you to tell you right now, what the hell are you talking about? How'd, how'd you get my number? Are you stupid or something? No, I'm just asking. How did you get my number? Well, honestly, I uh, I'm, I clicked into your Wi-Fi and I looked up all of your information. Well, I don't even have Wi-Fi. Well, somebody must be using your freaking phone number because that's weird. I'm telling you, I don't, I don't even have Wi-Fi. That's why I was asking this question. How you? I mean, that's, mm-hmm. I mean, I ain't being a jackrabbit or nothing about it, but I'm just saying. I mean, how did you get my information? Is what I'm wanting to know because you're acting a little I'm, squirrely. If I can be, uh, you know, honest. I mean, no, I ain't acting squirrely. I'm just saying I don't have Wi-Fi here at all myself. Well, maybe it was your phone. Does your phone have internet? Because it did say something my, my about phone phone. Got, my phone. My phone ain't got Wi-Fi. But does it have, uh, like, 4G? All it's got is 4G. That's yeah, all. that's what I'm hooked into. It's not like... It's like a hot spot is what it is. Are you, are you like, one of those kangaroos? No, I'm not a kangaroo. I mean, I, I, mean, I was just curious. I mean, you're probably recording the whole phone call anyway. That's silly. But here's the thing. Um, I... I did get some scratches on my drone, and I would like you to pay for those to get fixed. Well, I'm telling you, I'm not paying for nothing. How about that? Do you have because insurance? You no, I ain't got any insurance. I sure don't. Of course you because don't. You couldn't, because, you, because you couldn't have, shouldn't have been draw, flying your drone. If you want to be techno about it, I can take and take your phone number to the police station. Now, I don't you want to get smarter, be, like I don't want to be techno about it. Okay. Well, I was saying born you in the eighties. I don't mess with techno. Well, I'm just saying you, you sitting here saying you 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 flew your drone and it hit my vehicle and got scratches on it. Well, first of all, you shouldn't even been at my. If your drone has scratches, then my truck has scratches. Let's go there. I mean, I I can take mm. and call the police and tell them to come out here. And I can give them your phone number and tell them to call you. How about that? Well, how about I call the fucking sheriff and tell them that your fucking car scratched up my drone, you fucking kangaroo well, Canadian. My truck has been parked the whole time. Sure it has. Prove it. My truck's been parked right here in my driveway. Prove it, asshole. I don't know who you are, but I'm fixing to call the police station and give them your number and tell them what you're doing. Well, I'm fixing to come over there and brush your fucking hair. No, you ain't fixing to do nothing. Oh, I am fixing to do exactly what I said. We got a problem? No, nobody said we got a problem. Let's solve it. You have a nice night. Something about my DJ on the mic. What? No. don't I said have a nice night. I'm not going to sit here and talk to nobody on the phone. Okay, well, maybe you should be more careful. Oh, that was a good one. Sorry, Nana, and I tried. <laughs> Thank you, anime girl. That was fun. I like that guy. These two anime girl calls. Oh, shit. Okay, I thought you said you didn't want to talk, and now you're calling me back? Yeah, that's what I thought. Motherfucker! Okay, I'm sorry to get sassy. Hey, boy, and Rachel. <laughs> hey, yo, boy, you so bitch that you had your fucking girl call my daughter, you fucking faggot. Oh! <laughs> you your fucking number on my car. It's you lucky bad. you ain't touch my shit, you motherfucker. Ooh. Give me a call, motherfucker. You see my number, right? Call it, bitch. And I have your whole call, you fucking faggot. Hey, Roy, you got balls enough to leave a fucking note on my car, motherfucker. Talking shit about my daughter and my granddaughter, but you can't answer the phone and you have your bitch call my daughter the fucking actual apology. Call me back, motherfucker. If you such a man, you faggot. Yo, bro, what is this? 
Hey, bro, you got balls enough to leave a fucking note on my car, but you ain't got balls enough to call me back as a man yourself, faggot. Oh, should I be you gotta a have man? Your bitch. <gasps> should I do my man voice? <laughs> what is this? so stupid. Should I do my man voice? This is a blood feud now. <gasps> That's a good idea. This is a blood feud now. McCurr. He's sassy. Should I be a man? Is that the father? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I am a man. Okay. I'm. Hey, this is Roy. I got big balls. My balls are so big. I barely walk. Okay. Yo. Yeah. It's Roy. Yeah, is this Roy? Yeah, it's Roy, motherfucker. Yeah, so you trying to disguise your voice, you faggot? You want to make out with you me? Like, you like, you like, you like putting motherfucking notes on my car, motherfucker? Whoa, Lucky I ain't no. catch you, because I done broke your neck, thing. nigga. Whoa. And you got your bitch, and you got your bitch calling my daughter? Motherfucker, your daughter asking for calling me, you faggot. Your daughter called you me, faggot. she was a bitch. You got, you got your, you got, and you calling from your wife's phone, you faggot. So you're the one Oh, hey, this doing is Roy. Cocaine. This is you're... Roy, bitch. You're a fucking homo, nigga. Yo, Whoa. yo, yo, check this out. You like putting notes on people's car? Check it, you don't want to know what you put a car on, motherfucker? Hey, yo, 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 huh? shut up, motherfucker. Listen yo, to yo, me. Yo, I can tell you, I can tell your whole voice is disguised, motherfucker. I'm going to kiss you on the fucking mouth, and I'm going to fucking... You ain't going to do shit, faggot. Listen. You ain't going to do shit, faggot. Because you it's had your girl call my daughter, faggot. I will call you your faggot, daughter nigga. again. Is that what you're no, asking look at you, me to Look do? at you disguising your voice. This is my natural voice, nigga. You fucking faggot. Okay, this, your is, girl call. this is my natural you had your girl voice, call. too. That was me. It was me. Why, yeah, are you you being so, why are you being mean to Roy? Because, okay? because fuck, fuck you and Roy because you call my daughter. First of all, you put some shit on my car. That's not my daughter's car. I my gave car. you a note. You were doing drugs. No, fuck that. You put cocaine on my note. You I don't do no fucking cocaine. You faggot. did cocaine, asshole. No, your mama did cocaine, bitch. I don't do nothing. I don't drink enough of you fucking faggot. Prove it. You motherfuckers want to fucking play games? Take a drug test huh? right now. Yeah, t t take a drug test for my dick, bitch. You don't yeah. have a dick. Yo, y'all motherfuckers are soft. Yo, you know what, man? Y'all niggas ain't got no... That's how. That's why y'all leave notes. Because you're fucking suckers. Motherfucker. And you call my daughter. Motherfucker. And I know y'all crackers. Because you motherfucker talk about hip-hop. The fuck are you my talking daughter about? Your daughter was listening to gangster rap with her Who daughter. Who gives a fuck, bitch? That's my car. There was a child. My car. And this is her father. Motherfucker. That's my car. Are you my her, car. Are you her real that father? I, bought, I bet you whatever car y'all riding in that y'all got notes on, right? My car. That's for I don't court, have a car. Yeah, but y'all put notes on the car for parking, right? So yeah, you don't have a car all of a sudden? Because she parked like a fucking asshole. That's why. But y'all don't have a car? Are you kidding me? You I kidding me? You kidding me? So you and Roy on some bullshit then, huh? You and Roy on what? Y'all probably doing coke. No. Yeah, we're I Christian. bet you are. We don't do drugs. I bet you. I bet you wish that you knew what what number it was so you could get coke, huh? Y'all doing coke? Huh? Ooh, Why your soft ass man ain't on the phone? You got me good. You got me good. Why your soft ass man ain't on the phone? You want to talk to my man? Yeah, put that bitch ass nigga on the phone. Shit, you couldn't handle him. Man, I'll beat that nigga the fuck down. He'd probably be like, hey. And spit in his ass. Yeah. And then fuck you, bitch. <gasps> Would you do a huck to her? Let's be topical. Look at you. You a horny asshole, ain't you? I'm super horny, yes, all the time. It's yeah. okay. And so Roy ain't doing the job, huh? Uh, He's not digging me down the way he should all the time. I'll That's be honest. That's crazy. Maybe you can tell him. That's crazy. Too. So crazy. So, so. so. So did Roy have you put that that shit on my car? Yeah, he asked me to, but it was him. He was the one who um, dinged your car. You know your daughter. Didn't even, your daughter didn't even put her shopping cart away. She's a total Look bitch. It. My daughter. You know what? That's a fucking. I'll, I'll, that's also, a fucking thing. Uh, your granddaughter is a real fucking bitch. 
<laughs> She's looking at me like, and I'm just like, man, yo, that little fucking. You a bitch. white boy? You yo you yo. Uh, hey, how dare you? You know what? You know what? You, 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 you want you want you want to. You you one of the motherfuckers that just like to play games because you're a phone gangster, huh? Yeah. Yeah, you Yeah, are. I would never do any of this to your face. I'd get my ass kicked. Yeah, you would. Yeah, you I would. Know. Put your girl back on the phone because I want to talk to you her. Never left she the phone, like she stupid. Get She's right here. Put yeah, her on the phone. I'm right here. Like, right you don't here. have to put her on Is the this, phone. She never was left. it Rachel? Yeah. And so that's that's Roy for real, or is it a fucking uh, no, uh, that's microphone? Roy. Did you hear a voicemail, dummy? Roy, Roy's a Roy. How you we, fuck we, with we a soft ass dude like that? We, we made the cutest. Oh, y'all, 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 together. Y'all, yo, you lucky you didn't put your hands on my car because I'd have found you. Oh, I put my hands on your car. He farted. Yeah, he on, he farted on your car. My, yeah, well, <laughs> while I was while I was farting. I had my hands on the hood. Ooh, wee, that really just I, I was getting some car. air. You, you see what I'm driving, though, right? Yeah. Yeah. Just piece yeah. of shit. Garbage yeah. car. Yeah. I'm throwing yeah. up these gang signs. Do you see those gang signs? 20, 20, 20, 2021 CT5 Cadillac. That's old. Why do you have such an old yeah. car? Oh, what you driving? You know what? Wait, what you hold on. Roy? Do you know what I'm that car is? Wait, wait, wait. No, I want to I hear Roy talk. Let Roy talk. What you driving, Roy? Yeah, honey. The men are talking. <laughs> okay, well, I have to go pee anyways. Fuck you. All right. Uh, oh, he got to pee? I don't have go a car. Go hold his sir. dick for him. I don't have a car. Matter of fact, matter of fact, wipe his ass while he sits down to pee. Because no, he sounds like a has, bitch. She has to pee. Because any, any, any faggot bitch nigga would put a fucking sign on a car instead of waiting to see what the repercussions is for doing that shit. Yeah, I didn't want to. You a homo, nigga. And you, and, you, and you had your bitch call instead of you, like a man. You a That's faggot, right. nigga. Oh, I know. Yeah, you a faggot. You like being a faggot? Mm-hmm. Yep, it's the mm, best. You like getting addicted in the butt, huh? Uh-uh-uh. Yeah, you do. Yeah, you a fucking homo. You're just Put jealous. your bitch back on the phone. You're I want to talk to her. Uh, Matter of fact, I want to talk to your bitch. I, I want to talk to your bitch. Put your bitch back on the phone, dog. She's in the bathroom, if you've been listening earlier. Oh, she 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 wiping she she sitting down like you do. Yeah, yeah I was peeing. Probably. Oh, put her on the phone. I don't even want to talk to you no more. I don't even want to oh, talk no. to you no more. I'm gonna stay hey, here. Hey, hey, Rachel. Rachel. What's up? Rachel. What's up? What's up, girl? What's up with you? Uh, well, I just wanted to say before when you rudely interrupted me, mm. that your car is basically a car like everybody knows that you fuck. Do you fuck? Of course I do. How the fuck you think I got it? Oh, you got your car from fucking. No, no, of course not. I get to fuck a lot because of that car. Oh, oh, okay. <laughs> no, Rachel, you uh, like that one, right? Hey, 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 dog, Roy, get yeah. off the phone, dog. Oh, I don't no, like booty. I'm, I like pussy. Nope, I'm staying get here. Get off the phone, bro. I want to talk to your girl. I'm listening to you. Because she's braver than you. She's braver no. than you. She braver than you, nigga. You know what? She called and your fucking you, ass didn't. If I see you, I'm going to kiss you on the mouth. I'm oh, gonna man. Kiss, we're going to make out. I'm going to stick my tongue in your mouth. I knew you was a homo. Can I talk to your girl for a second? Don't say you don't like it because you, you know you want to now. You're thinking about it, aren't you? Come hey, on, let's make, let's make out, buddy. Can I watch hey, you guys make out? Will you make out? She's, she's going to She's gonna video it for us, okay? She's going to put it on the Instagram. Oh, yeah. Can I? This aggression won't stand, man. Will you yell at us some more? That's what we really want. Come on. Yell. Is that your stupid fucking granddaughter? Yeah. He sounds like a real bitch. That granddaughter of yours. She's a real bitch. Wait, wait, wait. So, 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 wait a minute. I got a question for you, homo. So, you that gangster that That's you Dr. call Homo, sir. Baby? Doctor? Yeah, so, Dr. So, what, you homo. like to play with balls, motherfucker? Yeah. Put your bitch on the phone, That's nigga. what doctors do. Put your bitch on the phone. Well, from now on, you address me as Dr. Homo. Put your bitch on the phone. I'll put you, I'm going to call you Dr. Put your bitch on the phone. Put your bitch on the phone. Say, put doctor, your bitch put your, on your bitch on the phone. Doctor doctor homo. <laughs> 
doctor, put your bitch on the phone. So you have to call me Doctor Homo. Come on, put the put the put the doctor put your bitch on the phone. As I explained before, she never. Because more braver than right you. Here, you, you, years, you, stupid. you like you like you like dick, don't you? Yeah, we both do. Ooh, we love oh, we God. But, but see, that's why I want to talk to her. I don't want to talk to you. How big is your dick? I, I, I want to talk to her. Oh, are you going to talk to her? I want to talk to her. I don't I'm even gonna, want you I'm in the subject here. no more because you had her call anyway. Okay, but you I'm going to anyway. put my put, phone put on mute. Baby on the phone. I'm going to put my phone on mute and I'm going to stroke my dick while you guys talk, okay? Go, go, go. Yeah, homo. Do that, homo. Whoa, hey. Yeah, Rachel. And what's He's up with that bullshit with your fucking homo ass man? That's what you like? You like that? You He's like sensitive, fucking with okay? He's sensitive and he he That's knows why you married him, right? Means. Yeah. That's that's why you married him because he's a faggot and he likes to get punished. I mean basically he'll let me um do the whole strap on thing. That's crazy. Have that's you ever been fucked in the bitch. ass? Never. I'm a gangster bitch. Well, I'm a Never dominant ever. woman, so I like to be in charge. Have you ever been kissed on the no. mouth? That's crazy. But I'm going to tell you like this. If I ever catch anything on my car from y'all, I will find y'all. I'll oh, that's kill a challenge. You. That sounds like a challenge. Mm-hmm. Let's do it. What if I... Oh, he gone. <laughs> <laughs> he doesn't like... He doesn't like thinking about us kissing. <laughs> he said no. That was awesome. Sorry I had to add you. He was asking for you. <laughs> oh, that's okay. All right. <laughs> I appreciate it. Anytime. Thanks for calling all my ding numbers. Thank you for giving me ding <laughs> numbers. He's like oh, yeah. saying, like, you, you called my daughter. Like, and she's just the one that picked up the phone that time. Not like we summoned her. She's or, the one or, that left a message. He? Yeah, that too. With that phone number. What the fuck else would you think? Like, uh, she said, fuck you. Hello. So did we give um, Bear like a hundred faggots to, to take out of the show? <laughs> well, we're already <laughs> past the 20 minute line, so I think we're good. I think. Oh, it's okay. okay later in the show? He just said like twenty, the first 20 minutes. <laughs> then you make up for it by having like a billion in words and bag at words and yeah, horrible. Good job. Thank you. That so basically, it's my fault. It was your fault. I mean, it, you're the one antagonizing him. You know, hi, Dark yeah, Meta. <laughs> Okay. I didn't even know that I got that many cardings this week. That was all of them oh. that you tried. Ooh. Oh, shit. I wish, you, I, I wish you would have got hold of that first old lady. She sounded hilarious. <gasps> She's my new favorite person. I'm going to collect old ladies. I have Anne. <laughs> and now I need this lady. Get them oh. to send you pictures and what you can make cards. What cute name? Uh... Oh. It sounded like one name, but it was another. Quick okay, pattern. I'm the person you think. Yeah, I don't. <laughs> fuck. She is the cutest. I was like, oh, I love you. <laughs> <laughs> cute, cute, cute. Okay. Right, Chat room's yeah. totally failing us. Devin's making an old lady Avengers team. <laughs> yes. You should find 30 old ladies named Helen. <gasps> 30 or dirty old ladies? What did you say? 30. I think it's 30. <laughs> you need 30 Helens. What does that mean? And then you can get them to agree on something. <laughs> what? <laughs> what? <laughs> it's an old skit. Skit from the kids in the hall. They were always like, 30 Helens agree that Canada was better before. Oh. I don't and, know about that. And then they'd show like 30 Helens and <laughs> they would be agreeing. Agreeing. Okay, I like it. Freaking creeps. Well, that was um, a good one. Oh. Yeah, I like that one. That was a good one. That was a good one. Thank you. Call the group convicted Helens. <laughs> <laughs> That's a great name. Mm-hmm. Okay. 
Oh. I was thinking about that clown lady. The clown lady that... That, um... Will Ferrell thing where he's like, Aubrey Clown! The clown breeder! It's all not to look in the cages. Your call has been forwarded to voicemail. Shit. The person you're trying to reach is... Okay. Oh. Oops. I did that. Hello? What is going on? Uh. Whoa. Hello? Oh, fuck. I don't know what's going on here. My Skype's being a real piece of shit. I'm sorry, Brad. I don't know what my Skype is doing right now. It's blacking out like a creep. Oh, yeah. Let's do this. Okay. Oh, no. What is the clown breeding? Oh. Hey, come on down. To down my head out. Original child clown out. I'm the original child clown out. Clown out. Clown out. Clown out. Clown out. Hello? Hi there. Um, my name's Olivia. I was just calling. My friend Paul got a call from this number, uh -huh. and I was just calling back because the number had said for the lady to call. Oh, that was you. Yeah, you had left me a voicemail. Yeah, I got a, we got a message on my friend's car, so yeah. I was just calling. Yeah. Hi. Hi. I farted on your car. Yeah, I saw that. Yeah. Um, just curious if there's anything else to do with that or what was going on. Honestly, I just saw the way you were dressed and, like, it made my bowels get a little crazy. Like, I got a little turned on, but then it moved up into my sphincter. And I was like, oh, I got to fart. And so... I thought I would leave you a little gift, you know, kind of like, almost like leaving my stench on you, like peeing on you like I'm a dog, but I'm not a dog. Okay. Um, are you from the area? Is that how you saw Paul? Yeah. Mm-hmm. And also I have IBS. Okay. Um, well, is that, is that all you wanted him to know that, you know, he was dressed well and that you wanted to leave the scent on him or on his car? Well, why? But why did you call? Like, because are you his lady? Uh, well, you asked the lady to call in the voicemail, so that's why I was calling. Well, but you're the one who left me the voicemail. I am, yes. Yeah, so that's what I was saying. I, I was wondering, are you his girlfriend? What's going on? Yeah. I am, so I was just curious what was going on. Oh, okay. Well, he looks like he cleans his balls, and I appreciate that. Does he have, like, squeaky clean balls? Um, I'd rather not discuss anything about that, uh, but I can definitely pass the message along for you. Is there anything else that you, that's, you, you wanted to mention? Um, I mean... He looks like he works out. Yeah. No, no he's great. What um, does he do but, for, like, where do you guys go to the gym? Well, again, I just kind of don't really want to discuss too much further, uh, but I just wanted to get a sense of what was going on with is there, the note. Is there a um, reason you're making this weird? I don't know. I just feel a little uncomfortable with it. So Why? That's all. Why? But that, that's just me. Okay, you know, were you touched person. as a child? Is that what's going on? Are you not comfortable with your sexuality? No, nothing like that. I just was just curious about why you left the note about the fart on the car. 
but I'm glad that we got that cleared okay, up. Okay, so um, you're a but... fucking weird prude. All right, well, you know what? Maybe you should uh, expand your horizons, honey. Okay? Okay. Would you I, be interested thank you for in a three-way back. or what? I like no, vaginas. thank you. you know? Are you sure? My apologies. But I'm, I'm gonna um, I'm gonna try my hardest to suck your boyfriend's dick with his approval and consent. Um, okay, I would really appreciate if you didn't try that. Um, it's I was gonna happen. Better. I'm gonna need you to accept it. Okay. I would just ask that you be kind and maybe uh, don't step over any boundaries. Okay, well, can you lay out some boundaries for me? I would appreciate if you didn't try to do anything with my boyfriend. Okay, I won't do anything. I'm sorry. Um, and I, I appreciate that. I take my fart back, but also, um, I'm kind of new to the area. Could we be friends? I'm a little uncomfortable right now, uh, but you know what? In the future, if I ever feel better about it maybe and so i'll keep your number and uh i wish you the best of luck so in the I future should, and so i should call you like every other day or i would appreciate if you didn't if i want to reach out i will right now like i said boundaries i am a little uncomfortable so if you don't mind giving me the space to figure it out that would be greatly appreciated you're so politically correct I appreciate you. Thank you. Who are you voting for? Thank you. Mm -hmm. I am not voting right now because I am not from here. What are your pronouns? Thank you so much. You're Canadian. What are your pronouns? She, her. Um, thank Could you, you so much your mom for on this the phone, conversation. Please? please put your mom on the phone. No, no thank you. Please. I'm going to hang up now. I really hope you have a great rest of your night. Take care, okay? All right. Well, I love you. And I hope you stay out of, out of trouble and also don't worry about farts on cars, okay? Because that's silly. Life's too short to worry about car farts. Yes, I completely agree. Mm -hmm. uh, Canadians' pronouns are a eh and guy. It, sure, yeah, that's true. Eh, don't you know? Like that. <laughs> yeah, you got it pretty spot on. Oh, you're just being, like, really creepy and very, like, you don't have an opinion about anything. You're just like, I'm going to appease this weirdo on the phone. <sighs> I was just calling to get a sense of what was going on. Well, that's smoke all. a little weed. You need to have a little fun in your life, okay? You're right. You're a little uptight. You're, right. you're a little uptight. Okay, well, I appreciate the feedback. Okay. Uh, like I said, I hope you have a great rest of your night. Take you, care. Okay, can we be scissor sisters? Bye. Scissor sisters! <sighs> Order is reading your voice messages. <laughs> Thanks, Gordo. I don't want to make anybody feel uncomfortable. I will not. I will do my best to not. I'm not going to steal any boyfriends or husbands anymore, okay? I've moved past that. Yes, because this is before I call you back. Yes, you can. Oh, I was calling about your clown... I was calling about your clown <laughs> collection and not your clown, your clown collection. My name is Rachel. Okay. You stole Brad from Nat Nat. I'm sorry, Nat Nat. I appreciate you not know, sucking like, <laughs> on my boyfriend. <laughs> I mean, you're welcome. It takes a lot to not suck off everybody's boyfriend, you know? 
I'm just like, all I do is walk around. I want to suck all your blue. Let's go. Put your pee pee in my mouth. I said pee pee. Okay. Um, where are we? We are here. Ooh. Oh, this guy lives with rats. Are you a rat? <laughs> okay. I'm in Jacksonville, Florida. I'm not shipping the clowns to anywhere. We're going to have an estate sale soon and I'll hopefully sell them then. Listen, bitch. I am in Jacksonville, Florida, <laughs> Florida, too. I just have a cell phone from out of state. I need your clowns. Okay. <laughs> Flirt? Who, wait, who am I flirting with? Gorgons. <gasps> I need new... Okay, I'll call the mole catcher. I need new stranger things. Stat. Okay. And. Oh, she said, oh, okay. Call me, you dumb cunt. What the fuck? What the fuck? Okay. <laughs> I just sucked off your boyfriend. <sighs> that is not flirting. That is that is sl slutty behavior. Bitch, the fucking call. Are you gonna call me? Or we will be at the house on Saturday, eleven to one. If you want to see them, oh, this bitch. Can I can I ask you some questions about them? Right meow. Right meow. She's gonna say no. You don't say meow. You don't say meow. Okay. Mole catcher. Alright, I've got a bunch of moles in my pants. What is that? Kitty, I hear you. Gordo is a dick. Can you believe it? Dirt man. <laughs> didn't, didn't even say Jig Mix. <laughs> oh no, I fucked that up. <laughs> mm. You know you're gonna love my clowns. Come on! I've oh. read them myself. These clowns come from Donnie's seat. <laughs> I try some other man's seat. My seat's fresh. <laughs> I keep seat's my seat in fresh. tubes and plastic bags. Put it in your wife, you get a clown in nine months. The women I breed with are clean and have real clown traits. Look, I'm a clown breeder. It's in my blood, it's in my balls. <laughs> my balls. Let's get something straight. It's not my fault. My son touched those clowns. He broke the golden rule. Never touch the clowns. Yes. But the clowns touch you. Hey. <laughs> Donnie says no. He should have used the stick to him. I told him, did he listen? Hey, that's for a jury to decide. My other son, Mike, got shot in the face. So come to me. Me, Donnie. Hey, for the last time, quiet. <laughs> I'm going to have to put him in cages they can't see through. <laughs> hey, this is Gabriel. Hey, I made him. He's fresh. He's oh, not a good time right now. I'm gonna have to, I'm gonna have to bury him in the back if he keeps acting like this. Hey, 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 hey. I'm the original child clown man, right from the back. <laughs> <laughs> so creepy. Okay, I love it. I love it. It's in my blood. It's in my balls. Yeah, it is. It's in his balls. What? Gordo is calling you on Skype. Are you threat? Nana, are you threatening me? <laughs> Nana's like, Rachel's gonna swim with the fishes. Nana's getting all Italian, Italian on me right now. Thank you for ringing. I'm sorry to have missed you. If you would like I'm to sorry to have missed you. Along with you. your location or postcode. 
I will return your call as soon as I'm available. Oh, he sounds you like a nice also gentleman. Send a text or WhatsApp message if you prefer. Sure. Many thanks. Please leave your message after the tone. To record your message again, press hash at any time. Listen here, I've got a problem with moles and I need some help. I need a mole man and I hear that you are the mole man. Give me a call. Okay, thanks. Bye. Hello, Peg Queen. Rachel Fulling during the year of our Lord, 2003. What does that mean? Murderers have accents? No. <laughs> That's a lie. You lie. Ooh. Okay. That's a lie. <laughs> Who just came in here? Wow, 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 wow. 42. Oh my god, I had a really crazy weekend, you guys. My mom's car battery died, and then I was stuck in the middle of nowhere, and it was, like, crazy. And my uncle came, but I've only met him, like, maybe three times. And he was like, I'm gonna go get a battery. So I got in a car with a guy that he didn't know. And they went to an auto store, and they got a battery. And then he came back, and his wife, which is my aunt, who I've met, like, three times... Um, was like, oh my god, my husband is gone. Where did he go? She was freaking out. And then my mom was freaking out. And they were like two old ladies freaking out. And then they got back and then he used the battery that he bought to try and jump the old battery that wasn't working. And I don't know why. He would, why? And I was like, can I just change the battery? Because <laughs> I've changed the battery before. And they were like, no, don't, what are you talking about? And my mom was freaking out because uh, apparently she's never dealt with a dead cart battery before. So she started crying. And then. Wow, dead air. That's not nice. I was talking about car batteries. I almost got sexually assaulted by a hobo. Just kidding, it wasn't sexual. It was a little sexual. I heard a cat in this thing. Hey, this is Melissa. Um, give me that. Shoot, that sounded like fucking <laughs> one of those phone sex lines. <laughs> Hey, what's up? It's Melissa. I didn't kiss you. Give me a call back. Sexy. I had jumper cables, okay? I did. He literally used the jumper cables to try and jump the old... I was like, why aren't we just replacing it? What is going on? It was weird. That took up my entire Saturday. So. I don't know. Okay, here's the deal. I dropped my mom off um, to go visit her fucking sister. Uh, that lady had nothing to do with us, so I don't give a fuck. Uh, technically, I guess she's my aunt, but fuck that bitch. I don't know her. I don't know her. And, um... So... Anyway, anyways, I don't know her. A portable jumper, yeah. And then some hobo came up and he was like, "Per per 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 per." Oh, I think I already talked about this, but I couldn't understand what he was saying. And he was like, "He's like, no, it's no, I'm, I'm like, why are you yelling at me? What do you want?" And he wanted me to fucking look up some hobo fucking hobo news or some shit. I was like, no, I'm not going to look up hobo news and you're going to eat a bag of dicks. And he was like, all right, I'm hungry. I will eat a bag of dicks. And I was like, "Mm, I'm going to watch you eat a bag of dicks. 
But that was just Brad in disguise. Brad, why would you do that? Brad, why are you making it weird? Okay. Oh, yeah, I gotta do koozies. Uh, where should I post information about ordering koozies or, you know, whatever? What would be a good place to post about that, I guess? You got Mark. Please leave Fucking me Fucking Mark. Piece of shit. Piece of shit. Okay. I feel like I'm putting non-funny calls on my YouTube too. I'm sorry. People are talking shit. I don't know what's funny, man. What the fuck? Fuck you. call has been forwarded to an automated I know they were like this isn't funny I was like okay <laughs> it made me laugh I guess I don't know I'll give you many only take oh okay that's okay you can get your everybody's in my in the discord duh <laughs> Don't be dumb, Gordo. Don't worry, big dummy. Punch you in your dicks. Okay. Oh, Walter's barking. Well, she had a Discord channel in World of Prinkles. I do. I still do. And it's a nice place. So you go in there and you be nice. You be so nice. Oh, no. I don't have. My, I mean, technically, I think I made one, but it's not like I haven't added people in. Me and I only smile in there. <laughs> Just kidding. I will send you a koozie, Green Imp. Send me a message with a thingy, my jigger. Hello. Hello. Hey, how's it going? It's uh, it's your neighbor, Rachel. I um, I I was flying my drone around, and I think I lost it in your in your backyard. I have no idea what you're talking about. I was flying my drone around and I lost it. It fell. I might have ran out of batteries. Have you your drone? What the drone? You know the flying the drones that fly around. I have not seen one in my yard, so I don't know what you're talking about. Well, can I come look? No. Okay, well, how am I going to get my drone back? There's no drone in my yard. I, I'll i send you a, a freaking invoice for the cost of it if I can't go get it. I don't think so. 
Okay, well then I'll be in your backyard. Thank you. What an asshole. Oh, look at this diggy little bitch coming in here. Asking to be his drone insurance. That's a good idea. The, oh, look at that. That just busted out with a bunch of stinky dinky numbers and shit. Okay. Oh, these people have a rifle. <gasps> I need to get somebody to shoot off a rifle. What? I didn't see that. All right. Um, Brad said we weren't invited to Thanksgiving, so <laughs> hello. Yeah. Mm. I almost choked on a piece of ice. I was flying my drone around, and I dropped it in your yard. In my yard. Yeah. Are you sure? Yes. How do you figure? Well, because it's pagan from there with my GPS. Well, you got a 208 area code. Sure, that's this is my cell phone. Um, I moved here probably about seven years ago. I got you. Yeah. So, so what do you want to do, come get it or something? Yeah, can I just go rifle around in your yard and find it? You shouldn't have to fool around if you got it got a GPS on it. Sure, Should but it's able. it's dark as death out there, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. What does the thing look like? It's got the it's got the wings that make it it's like a little baby helicopter. And it fell in this yard. Yeah, it fell in there. It's got um some green stripes on the side and like four of the flapper wings. It's you'd dark. Probably better. It's dark. You'd probably as... better. I started to say you'd probably better come in the daytime to try to find it. If you look it in the eyes, it'll fire a laser at your face. Maybe you can walk around. Is it got is there any lights on? Mm mm. No lights um, on. Well, the it'll look for your eyeballs. If it sees your eyeballs, it'll it'll put a laser at your face. Yeah. It can't. It's from. It's made in China. What color did you say? What gray? Well, black and gray. Well, black and gray. I don't see nothing out here in the front yard. Hmm. This ain't a very. This ain't a very big lot. Hmm. Is, could it be on your roof, maybe? Do you think I can I go up no. there? No, you ain't getting up on the roof. I have my own ladder. No, you're not getting up there. You make a roof leak on it. It's a trailer. You go crawling around on that. I'll be up. careful. No, I wouldn't have that. That'd be a liability on my part. What if I'm really quiet? Hmm? What if I'm quiet? It ain't nothing to do with quiet. Well, when do you go to sleep? The, I don't know how you got the number, phone number. Do I sound I like a robust woman to you? I don't know how you got my phone number. I That's am, what I don't know. I'm a little... Ro I'm a little... Uh, curvy. Well, what's that got to do with anything? Well, that's me going up on your roof. No, it's not my roof. No, it's my son's. Well, where's your son at? He's working. Well, I'll put him on the phone. He's working. Can't put him on the phone. He's nowhere around. Okay. He's at work. Oh, well, where does he work? Uh, he worked at Nissan where he worked. Oh, that's cool. For them, aren't, isn't that Japanese? What are you doing? Yep. That's I don't cool. see a thing. Are you disappointed in him? 
time. Whoa. I believe you're going to have to come in the daytime to find it. Okay, well, you have no right to defend your roof if it's not yours, so I'll be rifling have, around. No, you won't. You won't come on this property. Uh, yes, I will. When do you go no, to sleep? You, you come in the daytime. Do not come out here at night. Uh, you don't tell me what to do. Yes, You're not my father. No, but I'm living here. And I'm telling you not to come on this property. You're not my daddy. Do not come on this property. I am a night. woman. I am a businesswoman. You do not come on this property at night. You already been fair warned. Do not come at night. Are you, you trying to come. steal my drone, sir? That's not very Christian of you. Well, it ain't very Christian of you call at 10 o'clock at night. I wor oh, I come in the nighttime, sir. No, That's you don't. when I come in the nighttime. No, you... Yeah, no, because I bit. sleep during the day. That's your business. You need to get regular hours in. Uh, I don't know who you think you are. It's 2024. What's regular hours for you? Don't matter. You not don't come out here at night. I'm gonna come over there and I'm gonna be pooping and peeing out there, okay? <laughs> Who is this? It's Rachel. Rachel. Yeah. Rachel who? Slur. Rachel who? Slur. Slur? I don't know you. Oh yeah, Pardon. well that's fine. I I'm just telling you. My drone done stopped on your property. I'm just trying to get her back. You always come in the daytime. Do not come at night. Do you have uh, gutters? Do what? Do you have gutters? Do not come at night. Do you have gutters? Do not come over here. Uh, you're not answering my question, sir. What an asshole. Cum gutters. He does, I bet he has cum gutters. What a pervert. Sick pervert. Pervert. Wait, where did I go? No, I lost it. What? What is going on here? He's an asshole. He was an asshole. Oh, <laughs> hold on. Where did that go? What the fuck? That's some bullshit. Where did my shit go? Damn it, Devin. Why do you... Tresses are more than 16 feet apart. Okay. Mmm. Okay, we'll give it a shot. Oh, feet. <laughs> I don't know the difference between feet and inches, Brad. Why are you being so technical? Fucking bullshit. <laughs> Rude. Oh. Aided voice messaging system. Oh. Because you're going to load some equipment up there, if you know what I mean. Yeah. Where did my thingy go? Okay, um, I have to pee. It's really only been an hour and a half. Oh, I'm such an old person. Someone has to do the meal prep for the games. <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> okay. Is that my taco place? Okay, hold on. Hold on. Sorry, Danger Roof. I like it. Wicked and cricket. Um, what is this? Snappy. Oh, pressure here. 
What is this? Tell a lady to go to sleep. I'll call you later, okay? You won't call no damn body later. Okay, I love you. Call me later. You get off this damn phone, you bitch. Shut up. Oh, don't you talk to my wife like that. You, you better shut get your out whore mouth. You better shut up. You, can't you shut can't your smurf mouth. What's the matter? You ain't talking to damn whores in my house. Oh, he already know. has been, honey. You won't beat nobody. You get that bitch out of this phone right now. Still here. Thank you. You won't have the phone. Really? Really? <laughs> Hi, bitch. You better get the fuck off this phone. Hey, don't tell me what to do, you old old bag. Let me tell you something. I'll tell you what to do. Tell me what. You get off my husband's damn phone. Well, then stay off of my wife's damn phone, phone right baby. now. You understand me? But, baby, I love you. What are you wearing right now, well, baby? Well, goddamn, he don't love you. You're a sorry piece of whore and shit. I love you, I baby. Who gives a damn who you love? Oh, you, you must be drunk. How big a girl are you, baby? By God, you'll know what kind of girl I am when I get a hold of you. Oh, yeah? I'm going to come over and brush your hair, baby. <gasps> she said I was a sorry piece of horn shit. Horn shit is the worst. What makes it so bad, Mr. Pinnis? That's what I like to know. What makes horse shit so bad? Shit. Three. Man, six, four, the leaves one, are changing, you guys. It comes out glazed. Why is that a bad thing? <laughs> Why is that a bad thing? Okay, got me. Wouldn't that be good for the wiper? The wiper, wipey? I guess both. <laughs> you did i scare you it's rachel did i scare you i'm sorry let me let me cut this radio off while i get you sure thank you who is it rachel i was calling about those jalapenos and hot peppers yeah yeah you still got them yes i have do you know what kind of jalapenos they are? Ma'am, let me cut this truck off. Do you know, <laughs> uh, what are you asking me now? <laughs> Wait, you had a radio and a truck on? What are you doing right now? I was calling about the jalapenos and the hot peppers. I'm, I'm just coming home from visiting a friend. Oh, okay. Were you at church tonight? No, I wasn't. Oh, okay. Uh, uh, you, you, what church do you go to? Uh, I go to the. Uh, I'm the Protestant one where we have we talk about like um, we make salves. Oh. Mm. Uh. And we use a lot of incense. It's Our Lady of the Cacti. I don't. I don't understand what you're talking about. Sure, I was calling about the jalapenos and the hot peppers. I've got pepper, pepper, pickled pepper. <laughs> Can you say that 
Four times fast. Pick, pickled. Pickled say, is in vinegar. Say it. Say the pickled peppers five times fast. Pickle peppers, I'm pickle sorry, peppers, pickle peppers five times fast. Peter Piper had a pack of pickle peppers. Is that what you're talking about? That's fucking gay. All right, you son of a bitch. You don't have friends. Talking to people like that, you ain't got no friends. <laughs> fucking asshole. Pickle is a pepper. Fuck that guy. You're rude as hell. Listen here, buddy. Fucking guy. <laughs> okay, wait. What the fuck? <laughs> what is the point of a pickled watermelon rind? That's not a real thing. What? Oh, I'm not. I need an explanation. Because why? In V Naga. Why would people need pickled watermelon rinds? It was good. <laughs> it's like the part that <laughs> nobody. <laughs> Mr. Fitness, it is. What the fuck? Who does that? Hello. Oh, yeah, hello. Who does that? Hello. Yeah, hi. How are you? I'm fine. Oh, well, it's Rachel. I was flying my drone around. And I think I lost it on your property there. Um, I was wondering, can I go and like look around, uh, poke around a bit? Where? What property? In your house there. Where are you at? I'm, well, currently I'm in your front yard, but I think it's in the backyard. I don't see anybody in my front yard. I'm wearing all black because I'm a ninja, bitch. So I'm going to go in the backyard and look for my shit. Just don't fucking shoot me. Well, I may. I'll be calling the police. I need to live. Don't <laughs> shoot me. I'll be. What? Did she say hippie? <laughs> I tried pig's feet. No. Pig's feet. Oh, yeah. I think you named St. Jane. Let me ask about drone insurance. <laughs> oh, mom is funny. Do phone calls with me, Om um, Nom. <laughs> I think my mom said she had. She's. You see. This is Gloria. Pickle. Sorry, I missed your pig's call. Feet. Leave your number and name, and I'll be glad to call you back. Oh no, that's so gross. She said she didn't know what they were, and once she realized what they were, she was not interested. <laughs> I raise you one pant. Okay. All right. Let's see. You. Oh, no, you didn't break it. You didn't break shit. Ooh. Mm -mm. You ain't tricking nobody with those kill cool, kill cool spiders. I didn't think I would ever be like, wow, spiders are cute, but you changed my mind. Not all spiders are cute. Just your spiders, I think. Those are the only cute spiders. Um, yeah. <laughs> Those are penis. That's a good idea. You called me six times. I didn't call you six times, you dumb son of a bitch. I don't call anybody six times. That's crazy. Oh, the cutest little spiders. They're all fuzzy and they have like cool, cool eyes all. What's up?
They look like they want to chill. They're like, what's up? What's up, girl? What's up? Spiders are cute. But I'm not those really cute spiders. Oh. Um. Maybe I did call you 12 times because you have like 12 different ads. Oh, shit. I spoke too soon. Oh, wait. Hold on. I gotta find out what the areola code is here. Um. Okay. Okay. I went to the dentist, apparently, apparently, I have a cavity, it makes me very sad. <laughs> dang, dang, that is, <laughs> that is 100%. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. <laughs> <laughs> been there okay been there done that copy paste calls new okay I was moving a brown widow away from my door Oh no, it's gonna murder you. Oh! <gasps> That's a cute little puppy. Hello? Hello? Is this Kelly? This is not Kelly, no. Oh, okay. Because sometimes man can, men can have the name Kelly. Fair enough. Yeah. What's going on? Anything? Nothing. Anything else I can help you with? Yeah, I was calling about the pancake supper. <laughs> Well, I don't know anything about Pancake Supper, unfortunately. Well, that's Kelly, right? No, Mike. Well, I so on the radio, um, it said, call Kelly, ask him about the Pancake Supper, and it was your number. Well, I'll uh, have to call Tradio in the morning then. What, uh... Huh. Yeah. Okay. And you've got an Idaho phone number, so that threw me off a little bit. Oh, I'm sorry. Yeah, I moved here. I have a cell phone. Oh, yeah. You're good. My other from uh, Arizona, so. Oh, you're from Arizona? What part? Uh, Phoenix. Outside of Phoenix. Phoenix proper? I actually graduated from high school in Phoenix. Really? Okay. Yeah. Central. Central High School. Woo woo. I'm a bobcat. <laughs> Let's see here. Where where did you did you go to high school there? No, uh, elementary, and then we moved out, and then I moved back, and oh. we came here for work. Oh, We're okay. in uh, beautiful Woodward. Be beautiful Woodward. I sense yeah, a no, little. Right? Uh, like... I sense a little sass in that. Two one six three three six five. That is my phone number. Yes. Okay. Yeah. Hmm? The Washita Cowboy Fellowship. <laughs> <laughs> That's not you. <laughs> no, it is not. <laughs> Why aren't you part of the Washita Cowboy Fellowship? <laughs> well, I, may, I may have to be now. I'm going to need you to be because I really need some freaking pancakes. I'm hungry. I'm hungry. November 2nd. <laughs> yeah, it's... Okay. Well. Cool. Sorry, I can't help you. Well, what do I do for pancakes? <laughs> no, I don't know. There's no 24-hour pancake house in this town. So I know. We could use a knife. <gasps> I need help. Or a Denny's. Ooh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, I'll go with Denny's. Denny's okay. would be good. Okay. Fuck the Waffle House. You know what I'm saying? They're just dirty. They're fighters anyways. Yeah, they're gross. Ugh. So what are you doing here? You're doing work? What kind of work do you do? Uh, windmill stuff. Oh, cool. Okay. 
Well, yeah. what's your name, Dave, Dan? Mike. Mike. <laughs> it was a little off there. No big deal. You're good. All right. Well, Mike, thank you. And, yeah, maybe get your pancake uh, cowboy fellowship under control, okay? Hey, sounds good. All so right. have a good night. You too. I love you, Mike. All right. Say too. it backwards. Weird. I love you, Mike. I love you too. Thank you. All right. Good night. All right. Bye. Bye. <laughs> oh, too slow with that. I'm sorry. Windmills do kill birds. Dave Dan. <laughs> I was off. It was Mike. It was totally different. Somebody, <laughs> somebody's pranking that guy. Sorry, buddy. Somebody's pranking you. <laughs> I put his phone number on. Wow. And he gave it out. New boyfriend. No. Oh. I wonder if. Um, Walter, stop barking. Your call has been forwarded to voicemail. Thank you, Mark Zerby. I love Mark Zerby. Mark Zerby makes me want to flick my bean. Okay, hold on. Okay. Hello, Marcus Zerby. Yes, that's me. <laughs> that's you. How are you doing? I'm better than I deserve. Oh, that's why is that? Wait. So is... I, I'm, 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 I'm not sure who is this. It's Rachel. Oh, okay. You're, yeah. Um, we had had a discussion about wiener pegs. Okay, okay. Do you remember I, yeah. that? You, used, you don't have them anymore, though, right? No, I haven't got any wiener pigs. I'll tell you, I don't know why or what's going on, but uh, all the litters I've had this year, they have evidently eaten them. I had <gasps> one that was off by itself, and uh, there were four. One looked like it might have got stepped on or laid on, and I thought, well, they're oh. doing good. The sow was very protective. Hmm. And uh, then I went back and checked later, and there was nothing. So she that's protective the way that's... of her food. What a bench. Pardon well, language, I don't know. But... Yeah, I don't know if it's the other hogs that are eating them or what's going on. I, I haven't, I've never been there. But, you know, I'll see a sow, and she's filled out. and. And uh, obviously going to have a litter pretty quick. And then the next thing mm -hmm. I see, she's thinned out and nothing. And and the udder dries up. And, well, that's all that wrote. The, uh, my Cooney Coonies, I don't know what's, you know, the, they were a little short on good feed there most of the summer. And the heat, they didn't eat anyhow. Well, what happened but to now, the feed? The what? You oh, said they were short on feed? Yeah, I had that spoiled wheat, but it was a really old stuff. They were eating it, but... Mm, uh, and then strict. with the... Yeah, but now I, I've got some uh, better spoiled wheat. Actually, it's too fresh. A lot of it goes right through them. But a little more rain on it, they'll digest it better. Oh, okay. So any goodies, I can't tell... If they're pregnant or they're just so filled up getting fatter, I I hope they're pregnant. Uh, got some folks that like some of those. And if I can I can tell when they get close, and, and what I'll do is I'll put them in the horse trailer. Oh, that's uh, smart. So they're not around other, other creatures. Yeah. yeah. Is what happened, I uh, donated a big old, uh, oh, he must be five 600 pounds. 
to Adult Teen Challenge in Billings. Oh, that's nice. A, they had a benefit auction, you know, to raise money. And so this couple did him. And I, and I did say that they got me up on stage with the auctioneer. And I said, you know, oh. I'll, I'll, if you want a smaller one or whatever, you know, I'll work with you. So they bid it up to 800 bucks. Whoa. Well, you know, it's a benefit thing. And, and, yeah. And, you know, that was part of it. But other people were bidding too. So they came out then. It was a Friday. They came out that Sunday and looked at what we had. And they haven't decided yet whether they want that big boy to eat. They've got a horse trailer, so they would carry him to Columbus. Or they're kind of hoping that I'll get some of these cooney coonies, uh, you know, wiener pigs. As oh, soon as they can that's, they're holding out for the wiener pegs. Yeah, so that could be into next summer, or yeah, who knows what's going to happen. I, I, you know, I sure want to help him out. I, I said, you know, he could have a couple of them. My boys mm -hmm. you know, aren't with any of them. No, they, he's got a plan for them. Oh, that's nice. You're such a nice man, Mark Zerby. Yeah. I would like to cook you dinner sometime. Oh, really? Wow. Yeah, I would appreciate. I mean, honestly, um, what you do for the community is amazing, and well, thank you. Yeah, thank you. Yeah, well, yeah my uh, boy, I sold him eight Cooney Coonies, and uh, they're a grazing pig. They don't root. Oh. And yeah, they just been out grazing on grass and just as fat as could be. My one granddaughter, it's kind of her thing. Mm -hmm. Oh, they, they're, they're just her pets. Oh. When she calls them, they just come running and squealing. She's got the, the biggest uh, sow and uh, she just flops over on her side and wants her belly scratched. Oh. I'm I, I, dead. I, I saw her the other day. She was, uh, she had her laying down and, and she was laying on top of the hog. Just taking it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> her back was up against it. Yeah. Aww. And another one was out front stretched out. Yeah. They're, they're her thing. That's for sure. I, I had a kick the other day. <clears throat> she, there were just two of them that came when she had a, some, kind of treat you know scraps left over from the house and and the others were clear out in the pasture so she climbs and stands up on top of a, a railroad tie post mm -hmm. and she goes here kitty kitty and, and then at the end she goes kitty kitty and, I the end, <laughs> and they heard her and the, all the others just came running and squealing and, <laughs> oh yeah it, it, it's her thing yeah they know her voice that's yeah. adorable. I love it. I love it. You're a good grandpa. I like it. Yeah. 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 What I, are I, you I, doing? I, Do you go on dates these days? On, on, on uh, dates? I'm sorry. Your phone's breaking up. Oh, okay. What was the question? Oh, do you go on any dates these days? No, I guess I haven't. Oh, are you, um, are you, like, looking, or no? Well, you know, if you could stand a little humor, I, I'm i looking for a good-looking, blue-eyed brunette with a lot of money. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> I got two out of the three, or, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> no, no, more, more seriously. It'd have to be a really special gal. Sure. Uh, the first thing is, is you know, a personal relationship with the Lord and not just somebody mm -hmm. that believes in God, but has a personal relationship with the Lord. Okay. And then then, then I'm a, a pretty serious health food nut, you know, organic mm -hmm. and mm -hmm. growing my own garden and buying organic fruit and all nice. that. Nice. Don't yeah. eat very limited salt and it's Himalayan salt and sugar. Yeah. I try to a lot of honey, a lot of raw honey. Yeah. That's perfect. And 
so, you know, we'd have to get through all that. And then on the spiritual end of things, you know, all the things that separate different churches, we'd have to talk about that, you know, the baptism or Calvinist, Armenian, you know, we'd have to talk about that. There wouldn't be a conflict. Well, that's a start. Okay. And then this this poor gal would have to clear all three of my kids and their families. <laughs> the, and then after that, it'd be my brother and uh, sister, because we're we're all in an LLC together. Sure. And so, yeah, because whatever, oh, I I so it would be all in, you know. And so, yeah, mm. if I die first and this gal would live on, you know, my brother and sister would be dealing with her. And so. Oh, yeah, that makes that, sense. That, well. that's, so I, I don't know if that's kind of a lengthy answer, but that's, yeah, no. pretty much where it's at. That makes sense. <laughs> you know what, Mark? You know what you want. And that's yeah. completely, that's perfect, you know? Well, like I, mm -hmm. I said, it would take a real special lady, but. If the Lord wants me to get remarried, uh, you know, he knows where that gal would be. And the sure. best way to find her is keep seeking him. That's true. Yeah. Amen. Mm -hmm. Yeah. 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 Well, that's awesome. Um, honestly, I was looking for some wiener pigs. When do you think that they're going to be um, producing? What's... Yeah, well, there's some saws out there that are filling up, but unless I uh, put them in the horse trailer, I'll probably lose them. Yeah, uh, being a little sassy this year, huh? Yeah, so mm. might be next summer even. Okay. Uh, uh, the, uh, a funny thing happened here just recently within a week or so. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so, <laughs> evidently in the middle of the night somebody opened up the gate and dropped off a sow for me Whoa, what? no i'm i'm serious it's like a two three hundred pound sow and oh, and i my. you know i kind of check it through the herd in the morning i look at this one and that ain't one of mine <laughs> and i looked again no way no way that ain't this, this, and i you know she they kind of have a pecking order, the hogs do, and oh, yeah. she was kind of an outsider. I did see oh. she bedded down one night with the others. Okay. But so I, I noticed this morning, I all from the food bank, I get uh, a whole bunch of peaches. They're just plum going moldy. Oh, okay. And then they had some juice that was milk and orange juice, whatever, really a lot of sugar in it. And so, yeah, I, I pour that into troughs and drop the peaches out. And I watched her this morning. She got brave enough. She came up with the others, but she wouldn't jump right in the middle of all the squealing and pushing her out. She's, so I might have to start locking the gate so people don't drop off hogs on me. Just give her to me. I'll take her. If nobody wants her, yeah. I'll take her. Come here. I love. Tell. Have you named her? Do you name your little piggies? No, I. Okay. Oh, the uh, I I a, a couple. Okay. Okay. So the, this big old boar, he's probably at least six hundred pounds. Oof. He's fur. He's Ferdinand. Oh, he's <laughs> he, he's a real he's a real gentleman. He was mm -hmm. raised with kids. Fancy. And okay. uh, yeah, the only time I give him space is if he's got a sow in heat. Yeah, he can get real protective. Then. Oh, he likes to he bang her head over heels one yeah. time. He didn't bite me, but oh. he hit me snout, and I I went flipping. Okay, okay, oh boy, <laughs> I got those clothes. He said, "Back off my back off my yeah, lady." Uh, he got, and then I I had a uh, sow. And she was a Berkshire too, and she was probably five, six hundred pounds. Oosh. And I called her uh, uh, Mabel. Now she went to my boy in Absorky, and then I had another one. Poor little guy, he got stepped on when he was a piglet, uh -huh. tore half his head off. So, but you know, they heal up. So he just had one eye to see out of. So I called him <laughs> One Eyed Pete. <laughs> but, but but other than that, I really haven't given any of them names. Yeah, they, uh, 
I, I I call them names, but not nothing. <laughs> you don't cuss, do you? <laughs> yeah, I shouldn't, anyhow. Oh, that's what, yes, that's a hard yeah. habit to break. Yeah, yeah. So yeah, I'm sorry. I don't have any pig or wiener pigs, but I just. Well, and you know, I'm not feeling real bad because I just got too many pigs anyhow. I think I'm down to a little over 30 altogether, which is, yeah, that's still too many. Well, it was a lot more than that. I was up to, Mm. what, 50? Yeah, something like that. Yeah, I think it was over 50 even. So, yeah, I've got, Mm. got rid of several, and there's several people that have, told me they want butcher hogs this fall but Mm -hmm. you know until it really happens yeah it's whatever it's worth yeah so but are they good for like um for food for me oh yeah oh yeah the best oh the best yeah yeah anybody that's now the the berkshire i'm all out of the pure berkshire so there's some that might be three quarter Berkshire, but mm. there's quite a few that are half Berkshire and half Mashon, which okay. is the Chinese breed. Gross. Uh, those I bought at that foreclosure, they were supposedly half big blacks and oh. half Mashon, but oh. they didn't tell me the truth there either. There's a lot of other stuff mixed in, but everybody mm. that I've sold hogs to said it's the best best uh, pork they've ever had so. really okay how yeah. are they with yeah. racing R- raising them like racing like in a race oh okay well the little ones can run really fast but the big ones are slowing up <laughs> oh, okay <laughs> well yeah. what kind of <laughs> is it hard to catch the little ones you know what I've found, because uh, like the the little boars, I'll uh, cut them. Now I've saved, I think I've got four boars out there right now, which is probably too many. But the little guys, you know, I try to get them like when they're about two weeks old, mm-hmm. and by then they can run pretty fast. But I've found uh, the best way to catch them is with a fishing net. Oh. That works. That that works pretty good. And then, if if the sow is real protective, you get the little piglet in the net and then take off running because she might be after you. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. But yeah, I haven't had any to do that with for quite a while. But uh, yeah, that's yeah. The little guys they can really move. I'll Those tell like you, pig fish. Well, when. Uh, I sold those eight to my boy, the Cooney Coonies. Yeah. I had uh, all seven of my grandkids, grandkids out there and my boy. And, I mean, there was pigs going every which way but loose. Oof. They, they managed to corner and catch all except one. Oh, wow. And that one, that one managed to find a place in the fence and get out. <laughs> but he he came back in, and then I decided to keep that one anyhow. But oh sassy. yeah, I mean they, they they could outrun those kids like nothing. I think there was only one that they could run down. Otherwise, yeah, they had to corner them. That was the only way they could wow. catch them. <laughs> <laughs> That's awesome. Yeah, uh, but I I know the the like that that big one that uh, I sold at the auction. I uh, he don't move real fast. Oh, he'd run. He could, he could probably outrun a person, but nothing like the uh, smaller ones. Do the pigs talk to you? Or are they like? Rawr, 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 rawr. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. absolutely. Yeah, <laughs> and, and I and I talk back to him. <laughs> oh what yeah, yeah. Say? No, I you, you can tell by their grunting noises. And, and <laughs> well, like that big old boar, I tell you. Yeah. We talk back and forth all the time. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. He, he. I'll grunt at him, and there, and he'll grunt back. Or, <laughs> yeah, they make different sounds at different times. Now, sure. when one of them accidentally gets into the electric fence, that oh. don't happen very often. Oh. They're pretty smart to stay away. Yeah, but they let out a squeal. Oh. 
that is a different kind of squeal because any of them that are close will all take off running. Oh, they're like, get the fuck they, away from here. <laughs> yep, that's right. Exactly. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Like and uh, when, when they're content, you know, when they're eating, well, like mm-hmm. I'm dumping out peaches in the morning and, and I say, mm-hmm. here, kitty, kitty, kitty. And <laughs> of course, they come clear across the pasture. They come a running and uh, dump it out for them. And, and they make happy grunting noises then. Oh, yeah. they're hungry. They're but like, yeah. some of them, you know, they haven't taken down and they don't want to be touched. They make a not a squeal but a complaining kind of a noise. Oh, like yeah, like, yeah. They, 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 they all different. So yeah, I talk to them. I talk to them. Yeah, for I sure. Like Do you tell them all your <laughs> secrets? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so you do I like it. You know what? Yeah. Sometimes I do happy grunting. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Just so you know, like, um, if food's good, I'm like, rrr, 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 like that. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah. You know. <laughs> Sometimes. Now, now, my big boar, mm-hmm. uh, he uh, got tangled up in the electric fence. Well, oh. actually, I kind of brought it on. Why? He was a little close, and uh, I stuck a, a a metal scoop shovel between the fence and him, and it dinged him pretty good. Oh, and that and he was kind of in a little enclosure. I thought he was going to make a new opening, but he he managed to get out. But when he, I I've seen him like that before. When he gets an electric fence, he'll walk a little ways, and then he growls just oh. like a bear. Oh, he just growls. Yeah, <laughs> I bet touching that electric fence would give me a new opening, if you know what I mean. Oh, I'll tell you what, that electric fence, yeah, it, uh, it's it's pretty hot. I got one around my garden, and that one isn't near as strong. But Ooh. I've got a I've got a tester, and uh, the tester only goes up to eight thousand volts, Ooh. and so obviously it's more. Yeah, yeah, it makes a healthy snap. <laughs> uh if if the hogs hit it you can hear the snap and and if you're watching you'll see the spark yeah it's pretty hot Jeez. you're pretty but hot. that way it, it 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 burns the grass off that way too you know so don't short it out oh that's good that's good yeah yeah i like it yeah okay, it, it, well, it, maybe i can um i gotta get to bed now Okay, okay. I would love to talk with you about um, maybe looking into getting some feeder pigs uh, next summer, if that's you yeah, know, and yeah. then maybe we could just discuss other kind of um, adventures uh, in pig raising. Yeah, yeah, so, yeah, yeah. I would appreciate that, and I appreciate. Yeah, you. I'd be glad, glad to do it for you. Thank be glad you, to sir. do it for you. You're amazing. Sure. Thank you. Well, thank you for all the kind words. Of course, you're an you're a, an amazing man, and I appreciate you and your time. Well, thank you very much. Thank you, Mark. I hope you. Um, my name's Rachel. I hope you have a great night. You too. Have a blessed one. Thank you. You too. Bye. Bye. Okay, he can go on forever. So. I'm not looking for a granddaddy. I just love Mark Zerby. And uh, one time I talked to him, I was really high, and he was talking about wiener pigs. And I was like, this is a robot. I didn't think it was a real person. That girl doesn't count. Okay, well, I have to pee. So you're just going to have to deal with me peeing, okay? <sighs> oh, let's play. Excuse me. Let's play this guy. Probably not even here anymore. Freaking Cheech. But let's see. She's Cheech. Okay. Oh,
All right, then. Okay. Um, let's see here. Okay, escape. What's up, Walter? Are you trying to get a goodie? Okay, hold on. You want one of these guys? Okay. You get one and done. There you go. Quan and done. Quan and done. Thank you all. Good. Well, my name's Rachel. Are you guys doing a yard sale this weekend? Tomorrow? Yeah. Tomorrow and Friday. Okay. I was just wondering, can I um can I set up a a table out there? Uh well I don't know how much room I, I she brought some stuff from her mom's today. I don't know how much she's got. Who's this? Oh, my name's Rachel. I was just calling to see if, like, I'm just trying to sell some extra stuff. I need a couple of bucks for some gas money. Yeah. Uh, like I said, she's got stuff coming from her mom's, and I'm go I've got a bunch of stuff. Uh, I'm just not sure I'm going to have very much room out there. I've got farm equipment i got to bring out and some buildings and up like that i can just set up like in front of the farm equipment or the buildings well i part of my stuff's right out next to the road the uh, the chicken pens and all that stuff but i've got to get it out a lot because my goats are in there well i don't want to stand in the road i'm just looking for a side little side uh spot where do you live at well, I'm so I'm in town. You know where the Dairy Queen's at? In Green Forest. Uh mm huh. -hmm. Yeah. I'm just right there, like two blocks from there. But I just saw that you guys were having, or I heard that you were having a a yard sale tomorrow, and I was like, I don't have anything better to do. I'm coming um, over there. Well, there's some more that's having them uh, up there in Green Forest and Bearville, but. My buddy used to have them there at that Dairy Queen and out there at that, uh, uh, where they had the truck stop. He sold stuff there. Oh, wait, but I'm and, just looking to hop on your, um, all the, you know, people that are going to be coming by your stuff. So I was just going to set up, like, if you are able to sell your farm toys and stuff, then I should be able to sell a couple of my things. Well, it's, I I don't own this here. The reason that I I can't say anything, uh, I'm I'm having it here at this place, so I can't. Uh, Who owns it? My uh, girlfriend. Oh, well, where is she? Can you put her on the phone, please? She's what? Oh, can you put her on the phone, please? No, she's not here. She's gone to church. She goes to her mom's after she gets done there. Oh, who does she think she is? Do what? Who does she think she is? What do you mean? Well, just taking over this whole yard sale. Um, I thought we were a community. I'm just going to set up a table... Or maybe I'll just carry a box around and ask. I'll be like, peanuts for sale? Pe Do you want any peanuts? Like I'm at a fucking baseball game, okay? I'll sell my peanuts. Yeah, I don't know. She just, <clears throat> she, she don't really like, to, she didn't, that's the first time I've ever done this. I don't, she didn't really want to do it because of the people coming and going in and out of the yard and I'll but, be like uh, this. Ice cold beer here! Like that. 
Have you ever been to a baseball game? Ice cold beer here. That's all, dear. Hello? Why aren't you... So you're just not going to talk to me now? <laughs> you didn't like my... My baseball stuff. There's going to be... I saw the Yankees and the... Dodgers are in the... Fin out the... What is it called? What's the baseball stuff? The home run. Yeah, she's bullshit. Nobody's at church right now. <laughs> He's it was a girlfriend, it wasn't even a wife. Fucking pussy. Thank you, Popper of the World Series. Ice cold beer here Be peanuts. What else do they sell? <laughs> I would hate to be one of those people. That would be so uncomfortable. Gordon, I have a penis. What the fuck? Just because I know about baseball doesn't mean I have a penis. I used to go watch the fucking... Whatchamacallit? Call has been forwarded to an automated voice message. God, I'm God, so good. Okay, copy. Oh. <laughs> In my nightmares, I imagine you Thank you, my dicks are weird. Call has been forwarded to voicemail. I love dicks too. I like dicks are cool. I mean, some of them are weird looking, sure, but like, let's be honest. If we're into dicks, we're into dicks, and we are okay with dicks looking a little weird, okay? Okay? Arena with a belly. <laughs> this is James. I'm away from the phone right now, James. but if you'll leave your name number and a brief message. Cotton candy? <laughs> Peanuts? It's going to be here. That's all I know. Okay, fuck this radio. Oh, wait, they did answer. One of them answered. Let's try something else. What is this? Hmm, ice cold beer here. <laughs> <laughs> Don't look at dicks dead on you guys. <laughs> Side I am. Thank you, Say Flaylin. Oh, we got Say Flaylin over here. See why Flaylin. Uh uh. No, Brad, you take that back right now. Go to the pulling old dicks are here. Ice cold dicks here. What? But then people would run away. Popcorn. Get, gets your popcorn. <laughs> Thank you, Emily Smiles. Yes, I forgot about popcorn. But scratchers. All right, Nunu. Fine. God. Nunu's like, get your shit together, Devin. All right, Nunu. I used to do puppetry of the penis. 
by the strings, but the strings would get tangled. What would they get tangled in? Pubes. Pubes! <laughs> okay. Okay. My, ba <laughs> my balls. <gasps> Your balls get tangled. Oh. Those are big balls. If they're getting penis tangled. <laughs> Welcome to the e voicemail. I'm sorry, but the yelling, please. Okay, Mr. Smalls. <laughs> you know, I know it's kind of not a big deal, you guys, but this is all for memories <laughs> when I was younger. So stupid. Ugh. Sometimes I'm like, ew, what are you talking about? Ice cold beer here. Is Louise available? Huh? Is Louise available? I was calling about the pony trap gig. Wrong number. No, listen here. It's calling for Louise. You're in work with her. Oh. Yes. What about what? Sorry. Uh, it's the pony trap gig that has been kept in dry storage for over twenty five years. Pony trap gig. <laughs> oh, she go. What a bench. What a fucking bench. Okay. Night bags. Okay, so. Wanker. What a fucking wanker. Who <laughs> like my ice cold beer here? <gasps> what is that, Tom? Is Tom posting? It's not going to be good. This is the Vodafone voicemail service for. We know how Tom do. We know how Tom do. <laughs> um, what's that one cute show? Moon, Moon Boy is it? Moon, Moon Boy, Moon Boy, yeah, Moon Boy. That's so cute. I think he's Irish, though. Not to be confused with British. Okay, let's see. Here we go. <laughs> oh, yeah. People don't moon each other anymore. I was thinking about this time I was... Um, I would go on Greyhound buses when I was in Job Corps and I would drive back up to Phoenix on a Greyhound bus. And I would just sit in the back and like people and like truckers and stuff. Just to pass the time. Mm. Alright, Brian. I'd like to know your stories about Moonies. Hot dogs. 
Can you it's cool, man. Welcome to the O2 messaging service. <laughs> the person you are calling. <laughs> I love that name, CJ. It's good. I know Bray's like, I've seen all the butts. I've seen so many butts. <laughs> Your friend Moonju? And my boyfriend, oh yeah. How the fuck do you know about Moon Boy? Oh, Dark Man. I'm a big fan of Chris O'Dowd and I fucking love that show. That show is in my heart. My heart. Love it. Big fan of the O'Dowd. <laughs> oh, hello, you've reached Sam. I oh, Sam. Thank you. See you later. Hello, Sam. It's me. It's Rachel. Give me a call back. Thank you. Do you like that? That was a good one. She's she's gonna be like, holy shit, this is my <laughs> this is my sister from the Yorkinshires. We went to uni together. That's what she's gonna that's what it's gonna happen. Yeah. Just saying. Hearing double <laughs> I'm sorry, but the person you... Hold on. Did I goof? Did I do that? Did I do that? Okay. Let's go in here. It's gonna play. Two times are better than one. Okay, it's not me. Okay, thanks. I was like, I don't hear me. <laughs> Tell him cat what the fuck. Oh, two British people. <laughs> Thank you, Cyphalon was it was basically a compliment. And I appreciate you, Cyphalon. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Sorry to make it weird. It's all I know. Okay. <laughs> I don't think we're talking about the same moon boy. It's M O O N E. Are you trying? What? Okay, well, maybe we're not. It's M O O N E, boy. Mm. With the cutie patootie. Let me see. This little cutie. These guys, these two. They're in a cute little show. Chris O'Dowd is his little secret friend. His little imaginary friend. But it's fun. It's a good show. Check it out. It's a good one. Zero. Seven, five, zero. No. <gasps> okay. Where do we got here? What do we got here now? Mark, Marky Mark. Making the, making the rain. I remember that show. Yeah, it's a cute show. So cute. Mm. 
I think I only smiles wants to have a um <laughs> yeah I only smiles wants to have a <laughs> that's not nice that is not true gordo and that is not nice that is rude rude oh my god i like crime things okay i like crime things like other people but that is not a crime thing Wikipedia always lies. Wikipedia is full of shit. Because creepy people like you can, you know, make uh, make things up and put it on the internet. <laughs> Sorry, the number you have dialed is not in service. Please check the number you have dialed. Oh, she was like... She was like... I like it. That was good. Dark meta. Totally different thing, but I like it. I'll allow it this time, but next time. Don't fuck around. Just kidding. Alright, um, let's see here. Um, let's see. Clayton, mm -hmm. okay. this is Heather. How can I help you tonight? Hi, Heather. I'm staying here right now. Um, I'm dying, and I was just wondering, like, one of my... Uh, Bucket list things is having sex on a balcony. Will I get in trouble? <laughs> what a bench. What a fucking bench. Um. It's rude as hell. Mm-mm. She said, nah. Fuck you, bitch. <laughs> Thank you for calling Hyatt Place, Phoenix North. For direction, touch one. For the sales department regarding inquiries, for groups, catering, or meeting space, please touch again. two. For new reservations, touch three. For questions about your bill or a copy of your hotel invoice, touch four. To speak with a hotel representative, touch zero. All right, Skype. <laughs> you should have asked her. Gordon, are you being mean to me? I love you too, Dark Meta. Thank you. <laughs> I should probably get a Windy City Heat tattoo. I want to get like a why is the red body even there thing. Liar. Lioness liar. <laughs> mm mm. Gordo, I don't believe you because you're kind of a meanie. Kind of a meanie weenie. Meanie weenie! Okay. 
Get a basketball and a berry in the face. <laughs> you get a basketball and a berry in the face. <laughs> Okay. Let's see. What is that? <laughs> Stop it. Okay, let's see here. Oh my god. Oh my god. Okay. Don't name. It better not be like racist things. You can also. Serious? Oh, okay. Hold on, hold on. Your call has been forwarded to voicemail. The person. Bacon. Check us out online at ihop.com or the ihop mobile app, where you can take advantage of our easy online ordering system. To speak to a member of our staff, press three. How can I help you? Bacon. What was that? Bacon. Speaking. Um, they hung up on me. What can, can what, what, what can I help you with? Oh, uh, bacon. You just want bacon? Yeah. Um, you have bacon? Yeah, we have bacon. We have lots of bacon. You have big bacon? Alright, how many pieces? Um, you have big bacon? Baked? Bacon? No, big. Big bacon? Big bacon. Yeah. We just have regular, regular bacon. Oh. Hickory smoked bacon. Make a bacon sandwich? Uh, we have a BLT. Can you... Can you put bacon instead of the bread? Like, wrap it in the bacon... Bacon inside of bacon. So you want a BLT with your bread as bacon? Yeah, I want the yeah. Is that something you can do? Big so you bacon. You want bacon, lettuce, and tomatoes. I want like a a bacon sized cube. Looks like a sandwich. Can you do that? Okay, um, give me one second. <laughs> oh. Alright, how would you like as your size? Uh, bacon? You want bacon as your size? Yeah. Do you have any sauce? Um, we have like mayonnaise and I have sauce and the bacon? <laughs> honey mustard and ranch. And bacon sauce? No, we don't have bacon sauce. Do you have any other bacon based liquids? I'm so sorry. Like, I'm not trying to be rude. Is this serious? Is this order serious? Oh, yeah. Yeah. Do you have any bacon I'm, desserts? I'm kind of busy. Are there no, any we don't have bacon. Fried? I just have plain. I just have plain bacon. Do you have any bacon? bacon? I have bacon. Okay, thank you. You have a wonderful. Night. I'm gonna come in and get all that bacon from you. I'm gonna wrap that whole place of bacon. Oh, bacon. <laughs> Got her. <laughs> <laughs> oh, bacon. She got disgusted. <laughs> that was a good one, Dirk. I liked it. Thank you. <laughs> she got real disgusted. 
Hey, baby piece of shit. What the fuck do you want? Wait, that wasn't a real number. What the fuck? What did I do? Copy. I'm trying to call Chad. God damn it. Hey, baseball. I love you. It's Mrs. Baseball. Box is full and cannot accept any <laughs> messages at this time. Well, then McDonald's killed a couple kids with like Pokemon toys and shit. And, you know, it scared the fuck out of me when I was <laughs> nine. <laughs> We're all gonna die. Okay. Do what? The, uh, you had a motorcycle for sale? Oh, well. Yeah. Well, I don't. A friend of mine does. Oh, okay. Okay. Um, I was just looking, so I was trying to get this for my kid for Christmas. Mm hmm Does it work? Yeah, well, my friend is bringing it over to me oh, tomorrow or the next day to get the carburetors clean, but Poster okay. around. That's oh, okay. all I can tell you. Oh, okay. Okay, that's cool. Um, and it's a 1979? I think that's what she said. So, okay. That's cool. And is she, like, the only owner, or has it been... I... I guess. I don't know. <laughs> okay. Uh, do you think you can come over? Is she the one that was using it, or? I. Uh, what'd she say? Yeah, I don't 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 get me don't get me to lying to you. Okay. All I know is I'm supposed to clean up the carburetors on it. And... Yeah. Okay. She ever stick anyone in the cab? Huh? Did she ever stick anyone in the cab? In a cab? Cab. I don't know. <laughs> okay. Um, okay. Well, also, um, do you think I can come over and maybe sniff the seat if she's been riding it? You know, I can, all I can tell you is once I get it, 
call back. <laughs> okay, I'll be watching. I'll be watching your house for when you get the motorcycle, and then I'll call you. Okay. She ever ride it while it wasn't moving? She's never rode it. It's her son-in-law or something like that. Is she some kind of a fucking scammer? No. No. No, just... Okay, so you're the scammer. Um, no, I'm supposed to make it run, and then I'm going to sell it. Well... Or she's going she to sell it. I heard the mayor didn't like her, and now I know why. Who the hell is this? I told you, this is Rachel. And the mayor said, I don't like her, and now I know why. What? Well, she, mayor said something about the way that she did business was sketchy. That was a good hang up. All right, I appreciate that. Oh, you guys, I'm gonna go now because I'm tired and I want to go now and I have to pee again. And it's all on. <laughs> no, but I love you guys and I wish. That you would all lick my eyeballs and also lick my butthole. Oh, I need to figure out that butthole. I love you, Wow420. I love you guys so much. Thank you for hanging out with me on the Wednesday nights. <sighs> Thank you, Mr. Smalls. I'll have to do some more baseball yells. <laughs> I love you guys. You guys make me smile and I appreciate you. And you make me want to poop in my pants. Okay. That'd be weird. Being all sketchy. Hello. <laughs> Hello. Sir. Sir. Sir, it's Whoa. Brad. It's Brad. Well, I don't know who the hell Brad is. Well, I'm your neighbor. Yeah, I don't have a neighbor. I, I'm, like, way down the road. Why are you being like that for? Sir, you have the, the HP Johnson outboard. With the harness and okay. fuel tank. Do you have it or not? Okay. Jeez. Oh my god. Yes. I know I was yes, gonna I bite do. my head off just for trying to buy your stuff. Well you call me at this time of night? You're an idiot. Goodbye. Well, I, I'm gonna pay five hundred dollars for it. Well, you you, you full of shit too. No, I'll I'll pay five fifty. Five fifty. That's my final offer. Five fifty. I don't care if you give me a thousand. Six hundred. I'm not I'm no, not doing a thousand. That's okay. I, don't be an asshole. I'm that's not going to okay. do a thousand. That's okay. Okay, I'll do six hundred. Six hundred. I ain't giving it to nobody. Six seventy-five. Goodbye, motherfucker. Goodbye. Motherfucker. Motherfucker. Go fuck yourself. Fuck you. Hello.